I guess then we're back. So this is a lift tool here. And we can get really right up under that. So if I wanted to get up on the map, it'll get me that lift that I need to get up under my pedals. And it gets me right up under there like I want to. So if I wanted to do a little lifting, you guys can see the lifting. Now this is two different two different tools to lift with. This is a lift here and this is also a lift. And the numbers off of this is a craft tool. It is a craft tool and it's B60. Bradley 60, B60. So, but these, and this is another uh, Tandy's tool here where you have the two different size ends. Now, I like using this one better because it really gets up under there and lifts like it really needs to lift. And that, with that sh uh, sharp end, it, slant, it cuts beautiful. To me, and you just work this tool back and forth, and it cuts and lifts at the same time. There you have it. All right, now, so you guys know the secrets to how I do this. Uh, I tool along the back sides. I'm just going to accent this little part of the bud right here, too. I'm just going to separate that. Now, am I going to tool this part where these two buds meet each other? No, I'm not going to do that. I don't think it's necessary, but I will take my modeling spoon and cause a little slight separation on that because I don't want to tool that. I'm going to leave that just like it is. And we'll keep right on rocking and rolling. And here it is, you guys, right here. And I even did a little extra with the lifting right there and you guys can see that just not a major lift but you can see the lifts but that's how you do it so now tomorrow i'll get ready to finish this off well um, we'll finish this off tomorrow and then uh do a little antiquing on it and I'll show you how I use the, uh, the the bottles, the hemp bottles, to get into the background part, to dye those to where you don't have to do uh, paint brushing, which is a good, is a great hidden secret on that. We'll use the hemp bottles to dye in between the scrolls and then the leaves and all of the background. It's strictly for the background and work, not to paint anything else, just the background and work. So again, recapping, tooling or beveling, I always bevel the back sides of my bud and my, my leaves, my, my petals, bevel the, uh, the back sides of that. And I use my modeling spoon where the buds are about to unroll and, and bloom into flowers. So with that, hey, uh, let's get back to this. 